A transient ischemic attack is a condition where there is a temporary decrease in blood circulation to the brain. This leads to various neurological deficits such as weakness or slurred speech. It is also called a TIA. The difference between a TIA and a stroke is that with a TIA, the symptoms go away. A TIA is considered a warning sign for a future stroke. Therefore, you will need additional testing, such as an ultrasound of the arteries in your neck. The determination of whether this needs to be done in the hospital or as an outpatient is based on several factors, including your age and other medical conditions. Your provider in the emergency department might also start you on a blood thinner, such as aspirin. It is important that you follow up with your primary provider as soon as possible. You may also need to see a neurologist. Things you can do to decrease your risk of a future TIA or stroke include managing your blood pressure and blood sugar, controlling your cholesterol, and maintaining a healthy weight. A healthy diet and a regular exercise regimen are also very helpful. An exercise regimen can be started once you are cleared to do so by your primary provider. Also, it is important that you continue your current medications unless you are told not to do so by your emergency department provider. At this point, it has been determined that it is safe for you to be discharged. However, there are some instances where complications can arise. Therefore, it is important to return to the emergency department if any of the following develop. Headache return of previous symptoms, any symptom to suggest another TIA or stroke, fever, confusion, your condition worsens, new symptoms develop.